Do you know what type of heating fuels are used here in Prince Edward Island? And how the contents of those tanks can affect you as a buyer or seller when you go to sell your property. Watch this video to find out more, but before you do, be sure to hit the subscribe button, the little bell beside it, and to give the video a thumbs up. That's the YouTube thing to do. So essentially, in Prince Edward Island, on a residential basis, we're using primarily oil-fired boilers. So we're using heating oil as a main heating source, and additionally, some people will be using propane. We do not have piped in natural gas at this point. However, it is being brought into the island via truck, but it's only being used primarily in industrial applications such as manufacturing plants. So essentially, your house is gonna be heated by one of three sources normally here in PEI, oil, propane, or electricity. Electricity seems to be getting more and more away from the old traditional electric baseboard heaters, which just used to make that meter spin so you could cut ham, and it's going more towards the ductless heat pumps, which will provide you with air conditioning and heating. They work great with the exception of the really, really cold months like today where you've got minus 11, the heat pumps don't typically catch up. So you'd have to have some sort of booster system, which would typically be a propane fireplace or some form of radiant heat, or maybe you have an old oil fired boiler. So that's basically it. The question with respect to how does this affect you from a buyer or a seller standpoint is, that when the adjustments are made on your legal bill as a purchaser, you may be responsible for paying for the full contents of that propane tank and that oil tank, unless your purchase and sale says otherwise, typically in the form of no fuel adjustments applicable. Propane tanks cannot be owned, they can only be leased for safety reasons. Oil tanks are typically owned and they come in the form of a single wall tank, a double wall tank, and most recently the fiberglass tanks, which is what everybody's looking for, for, for insurance purposes. Thank you very much for watching. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, press the little bell, thumbs up, have yourself a great day. And if you have any questions about PEI real estate or PEI in general, put them in the comments below.